Okay, I turned Thank in you. this brochure that has over 90 different this. species, and I also turned in a list of YouTubes and a flyover, flyover of the area. And I feel very badly for the endangered species and species of special concern that are out there that are being deprived of fresh water by Playa Vista. I have a letter from our attorney. I represent Grassroots Coalition, and I have a letter from Todd Cardiff, and I'd like to read it to you. It's in reference to the CDP application number 5170253, item TH10C, oppose. Honorable Coastal Commissioners, I am the attorney for Grassroots Coalition and the attorney that brought a civil enforcement action in Los Angeles Superior Court to compel California Department of Fish and Wildlife to apply for a coastal development permit. Grassroots Coalition versus CDFW Playa Capital, Los Angeles Superior Court case number BC619 444. The case was settled with the agreement that CDFW would apply for a coastal development permit. Such settlement, which has been submitted to the Coastal Commission, should be part of the record before the commissioners. As is consistent with separation of powers, the settlement requires CDFW to apply for a CDP pertaining to the drains without specifying what time, type of action is required to remedy the violation of the Coastal Act. The settlement also does not impact the discretion of the Coastal Commission to approve, deny, or modify the CDP. My first concern with CDFW's application is accuracy. CDFW and Playa Capital still maintain that the drains somehow serve the freshwater marsh. Even the consultant from Playa Capital, SOMAS, misidentified the drains as BFM drains in their wetland delineation map, exhibits P7 through 29. There is no attempt to explain how the drain somehow served the Biona Wetlands freshwater marsh and appears to be a cynical attempt to minimize the potential impact that the drains had on the Biona Wetlands. In addition, the SOMAS report, hydraulic, hydro, Hydrologic Analysis for Freshwater Marsh Outlet Drain Risers, prepared by SOMAS for Playa Capital LLC on September 27, 2017 is not contained in the exhibits for the staff report. It is therefore, it is not feasible to review such hydraulic analysis and verify its accuracy. This brings me to my primary concern. The proposal and preferred alternative is to simply plug the weep holes and cap them. The required mitigation is a one-to-one -one ratio for approximately one-eighth of a cubic yard per riser. This fails to recognize the potential impact that the drains had on the wetlands for the last 20 years. While it is difficult to calculate the relative impact, mitigation should be imposed to accommodate the relative impact, mitigation, removal of water surrounding the drains in a delineated wetlands. We would suggest that at least a quarter acre of wetlands be restored independent of any restoration project in the area surrounding the drains. Such restoration efforts should include the removal of invasive species and the planning and maintenance of appropriate wetland species. In addition, the CDP does not require the payment of any sort of fines or any restitution for the illegal nature of installing the drains in a wetland area. While the settlement did require $20,000, $10,000 per drain to be provided to the Coastal Conservancy consistent, consistent with Public Resources Code Section 30823, the settlement explicitly reserved the right to demand additional mitigation and fines. Grassroots Coalition suggests that at least another $20,000 be ordered to be paid to the Coastal Conservancy because of the nature of the violations. Finally, the staff report claims that Grassroots Coalition has not provided any evidence of the methane in the water or the drains. This is not accurate. 
The problem with the methane seepage is well documented in, the, in and surrounding the Biona wetlands. The city of Los Angeles developed a separate methane code based on the concern that methane would enter basements at Playa Vista, causing potential catastrophic injury. Substantial water is being removed from Playa Vista to draw down the water table, thereby impacting Biona Wetlands groundwater table to ensure that the methane pumps and vent pipes work properly. Finally, Grassroots Coalition submitted video documentation of methane bubbling up in the Biona freshwater marsh. It is not a speculation speculative fear to be concerned about the potential capture of methane in capped and sealed risers, particularly when the consequences may be lethal. Methane is explosive at concentrations between 5 and 15 percent. The most sensible option is to require the full removal of the risers and lateral drains at this time, which will theoretically be required in five years anyway under the proposed CDP uh, condition four. At the very least, a mitigation measure should be added that requires non-flammable, non-sparking materials to be used if the drains ever need to be opened, Thank particularly you. when slated for removal. I Thank you. Like 30, 20 okay, seconds. please sum up. I had two minutes that I didn't use. Okay, the last you're, time I you're using that time now. If you want to sum up, you can have 20 more sec seconds. <laughs> okay, in conclusion, Grassroots Co Coalition strongly opposes the CDP as currently proposed, as it does not account for the damage that has occurred to the wetlands, does not even restore the area where the risers are located, lets Playa Capital and CDFW off the hook for installing and maintaining drains in protected wetlands and fails to even consider complicating factors of the undocumented methane seeps in the vicinity. We urge you to require the removal of the lateral pipes and drains. The imposition of proper mitigation for the loss and, re and harm to the wetlands and the imposition of a substantial fine to punish and Thank ensure you. similar <laughs> Thank you. I'm trying to give you as much time as we could. Thank you. Thank you. I, I want to commend all of you for uh, the Coastal Commission is really has gone from a place that I was really con concerned about coming to to something that is kind of a joy to behold. And thank you all for that. I know you're really making some efforts to to do a really good job. Thank Thanks. you.